Now I'm going to talk to you about a very useful tool. Uh, just like you can do in Word documents, you can copy and paste in MuseScore, and it transposes for you if you're copying and pasting between two different uh, instruments and two different keys. So uh, we talked about how to select multiple measures in the previous video that I made. So let's use that to select this. We're going to copy and paste this scale from the flute line into some of the other instrument lines. So in order to select all these multiple measures, click that first measure that you want, hold down shift, click the last measure that you want, make sure it's highlighted with that blue box around it. Now, just like in a Word document, control C is copy. And then we're going to select the same amount of space, the same amount of space or larger. It doesn't have to be exactly the same, but it does have to be the same or larger. So we'll go down to this clarinet line, select that first measure, shift, select the same number of measures, and we're going to do control V to paste. And like I said before, um, it does transpose in the same octave as well. So it's up pretty high. Um, usually I would I'd take this down for my clarinets or I'd write it in two octaves for them. So to take it down a whole octave at one time, control down arrow. And there you've got it. So let's see if it still remembers my um, copy. Let's see if it'll paste it. Yep, still remembers it. That's way too high. So we're gonna do uh, control down arrow twice, so down two octaves. And let's say, oh, I went and did something else, or I clicked on something else, and now it has, oh, it's still pasting for me. Okay, usually it doesn't do that. Um, sometimes it'll forget your paste or whatever, or you've um, done several other things, and uh, you have to go back and copy it again. So click beginning the selection, hold down shift, click the end of the selection, control C for copy, and... I can select a greater space than what I copied, but it'll just show up in the only the measures that it actually takes up. Bump this down an octave, paste it in here again, bump that down two octaves, paste it in here again. Do it for the rest of these instruments. And we'll leave it at that. Copying and pasting has saved so many hours. Um, it's a really useful tool. Um, let's say that you're entering something really complicated and takes forever. And then you realize that you have put something in the wrong measure or on the wrong beat or something like that. Um, you can select just little bits of and pieces of things to copy and paste. Um, and a lot of times copying and pasting, even though it seems like it's complicated, it will save you time rather than having to clear it out and re-enter it all over. So let's say I want to move this over one sixteenth note, one sixteenth of the measure, one uh, quarter of a beat. So I can do this. Um, just I just have to select the the part that I want. So I'm going to click. You can either push Shift and click it, or you can just click just click it with one click, and that's it. The beginning of the selection that I want, hold down Shift, click the end of the selection that I want. And when you are just selecting parts of a measure, you do have to click on the note heads while you're holding Shift. So I have. Clicked on the note head, hold down shift, click the end of the selection that I want. Control C for copy. I'm going to click in the white space. And this would be the, the next quarter of a beat. Uh, this is where I would want it to be, starting right here. So I'm clicking here, holding down shift, just clicking all the way to the end of the measure. Control V. So it pasted it. Uh, I needed to get rid of these two notes because I don't want those anymore, but it is in the space where I need it to be now. So I've selected those two notes. Control X will get rid of them. Um, I can change these into an eighth rest to make it look 
you know, maybe that's less confusing to some people, maybe it's not. Um, yeah, you can select multiple measures, copy and paste those, just little bits and pieces, whatever suits your needs.